Hi, I'm Jessica. I'm going to show you how to claim your Mount SAC portal account. If you need to use Canvas, you need to get your Mount SAC portal username and password. I'm going to show you how. First, you need to go to Mount SAC M T S A C dot E D U backslash E S L. When you get to the Mount SAC ESL website, go to Resources and go all the way down to Non Credit Student Account Claim and click. Now you need to enter your student ID number. It's going to be A, zero, and seven more numbers, and then click Submit. Now you need to enter some information. The first question is, what is your first name? So type in, what is your first name? Don't, don't write your English name or your nickname. Write your legal name. So this would be the name that is on your passport or on your driver's license. So write your first name and then next write your last name, your family name, your last name. Now write what is your birthday? When were you born? M, M means month. So if you're born in January, don't put one. You need to put a zero first. So zero, one for January. If you were born in March, March is the third month, put zero, three. Then backslash and DD means day. If you're born March 2nd, then put 0, 2. If you're born March 10th, write 10. If your birthday is March 10th, 1990, then write 1990. If you see Y, 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 that means year you need to write four numbers. So this birthday is March 10th, 1990. Now you need to enter the last four digits, that means last four numbers, of your social security number. If you don't, if you don't have a social security number, then you can leave it blank. You don't need to put anything. If you provided a social security number to Mount SAC, then you need to complete this field. If you gave us a social security number, then write the last four numbers of your social security number. Last, you need to pick one of the classes that you have taken at Mount SAC. If you took AMLA class, then you can select AMLA. If you took Language Skills Lab, then you can select that one. If you say, I didn't take any of these, then just pick AMLA or ESL. Then click Submit. Now you're going to see your Mount SAC portal username. So this is your username, and then you have a password right here. You want to write down your username and password or PIN, or take a picture of it. You can take a picture of it so you won't forget it, because it's very important you remember your username and your password. Once you have these two things, now you can access and use the Mount SAC portal, and you can also now use Canvas. If you have trouble claiming your Mount SAC portal account, or for some reason it doesn't work, please contact 
an ESL counselor, or the Mount SAC Help Desk, and they can help you.